black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. All right, y'all. We're doing a truck muck today because I'm eensy weensy hungover and I'm craving the absolute shit out of McDonald's right now. Just happens sometimes. Just gotta get your McFix, you know what I mean? And on the mind is a Big Mac, definitely some fries, definitely a crispy, cold Coke, extra ice, and definitely a double quarter pounder dressed up with a little jazz on it because that's just what's in my head and I can't get rid of it. It's in there. It's just, it's burrowed its way in. We're pulling up to the box. What are we gonna do? All right, y'all, pulled her around back of the Dawn spot. We got our sack, ready to get into it. Let's de-shade so we can have an intimate moment, you and I, eye to eye. All right, y'all, I gotta have the window crack because it is really, really humid out, but let's get to the first most important thing, and that is this double quarter pounder crave that I'm having. You probably couldn't see shit right there. First things first, this double quarter pounder crave. That's what I'm ready to hit straight away. We got the lettuce tomato added to it. We got mayo per bite schlopping all over, okay? This is what's up. This is my deep crave. Mm. Wow. I don't know when the last time I've even had a quarter pounder was. Certainly, it's been a while. But I'm all about it. This is definitely against the, uh, my better judgment. I did a full truck clean yesterday. Like I vacuumed it. I put uh, armor all wipes. I did all like the dash and everything. It's immaculate right now. And I'm just risking it. For this hot loaded juicy bird. But hey, you know what? Can always just clean it again. Mm -hmm. This is hitting the uh, the tiny bit hungover, just right. Exactly what I needed. Just had a couple uh, pretty bad nightcaps. Might have poured the last one a little stiff. <laughs> and that results in a uh, a little bit of a rough morning. Not rough, but just not fully 
100%. Wow. <clears throat> Even more perfect. McDee's Cold Fountain Coke. nectar of the gods okay emptied out my sauces just into here <laughs> much easier sweet and sour fries amazing but okay I've just been on the cooking grind lately a lot of uh chefing it up videos Kind of wanted a little day off to hit a crave, but I do have another subscriber sponsor request coming out with like a dip, some of this chicken dip chicken dip with crackers and rice crispy squares I'm gonna put a spin on them though the rice crispy squares regardless of that it feels like a video that will be kind of slow has potential to be long. Dipping crackers and whatnot. So in my community tab, I posted that I want like questions, weird questions or like never have I ever scenarios, shit like that. So that I have you know, some stuff to elaborate on and, you know, get a little rowdy with, have a little fun in that video, just, you know, maybe talking about stupid hypotheticals or just weird life shit. So go to my community tab and leave your inquiry in the comments on that post. All right. The mixed staple of them all, Big Mac. I'm already pretty full to be honest with you. I don't know how much of this I'm gonna get in me, but I'll give it a go, I'll give it a try. And that actually reminds me of a funny story at this McDonald's actually, specifically back in the day. Uh, <laughs> uh, me and my buddy, I don't know if I ever told you guys this. There you go, a little close up for you. A little first bite for you. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if I ever told you guys this, but uh, I used to be a duct cleaner. Me and my best friend at the time used to cruise around in this van. And go into people's houses and clean out their air ducts. And me and him used to love hitting Big Macs and shit. We would hit McDonald's pretty often. But one day he goes, how many single cheeseburgers from McDonald's do you think you could eat? And I said 15. Knowing that that's like a bit of a stretch, but I was pretty confident. He's like, there's absolutely no way you can eat 15 cheeseburgers. So, and this was at the start, I was like 20 or so, yeah, 20, 21. And this is at the start of me having anxiety, like more specifically 
uh, health-based heart anxiety. Because when I had my first panic attack, I thought I was having a heart attack. And then once I had that, I thought I had a heart condition. Like I thought I was dying of a heart problem. Even though I got fully checked out. And then all the doctors were like, you're fine, you're 20. Like you're just, it's just a panic attack. <laughs> so one day, he's like, I challenge you to that 15 cheeseburgers after this, after this job that we do. Because we would be done for the day. I was like, all right, bet. <laughs> Go get the 15 cheeseburgers. And while we're driving, I start working on them. <laughs> he pulls over to get gas. And I used to have this really bad habit of checking my pulse a lot <laughs> in my anxiety. And, uh, <laughs> I'll never forget it. I'm like on like my seventh cheeseburger. <laughs> and he's on the side of the van pumping gas. <clears throat> and in the rear view mirror, he just sees me eating a cheeseburger and checking my pulse. <laughs> and he fucking died laughing like he fell out like he just dies laughing stops pumping gas dies laughing comes up he's like what are you doing how many cheeseburgers is that like he's like are the cheeseburgers like killing you oh and i was dying laughing too because i got caught checking my pulse while eating a cheeseburger mid bite of a cheeseburger <laughs> so stupid <laughs> either way I did not get through 15 cheeseburgers I think I ate 8 yeah I did 8 and then I was done I was toast I was like so full and he's like I told you you couldn't even get close to 15 I was like you right you right you right <laughs> fair enough I thought I could Specifically because I remember there'd be times we'd go to the movies and we I would swing by McDonald's first and I'd grab five cheeseburgers. Just to have in the movies, in the movie with me. And in the movie, eating five cheeseburgers to me felt like nothing. It just felt like a cloud. Like it just felt so simple. But I guess that next three is really where they start to hit you, I guess. I mean, 10's a more honest number if you think, like if you think 10 cheeseburgers, that seems more reasonable for a max limit. But you know, I thought I had 15 until my fucking panic syndrome set in and then it was over. I think that killed my appetite. <laughs> But all right, I managed to keep the truck pretty much relatively clean. A few lettuce strands here and there. I'll pull those out here. But I got away pretty much scot-free on this one. Hit the spot. Be on the lookout for that next video. Like I said, go put your questions, comments, or whatever. Questions in the comments. And, uh, you know, let's make it uh, interesting, funny, zany, all the crazy shit that you might think of. Let's get weird with it, okay? Until then eat good, live well, stay true.